let's be real. Did you really think I was taking that small little girl backpack to college? No way. Honestly, that was $10 from Walmart and could probably only hold like a few notebooks and maybe even a pencil case. It didn't even have any side pockets for a water bottle. There was no way I was gonna be able to survive with that. But with this, I'm definitely gonna rock the school. After hours of searching, I finally found the perfect backpack for me. As you can tell, it's an amazing rainbow fire dragon, and it's totally gonna rock the school. I'm not gonna be one of those cliche girls walking around with their cute little pastel backpacks. This baby is gonna show everyone how cool I'll be at that school. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so let's start off with the front pocket of my bag. The only thing I have in here right now is my pencil case. Due to limited space and its large perimeter, it was the only item I felt a backpack could support without ripping. I got this pencil case off of eBay and got the design idea from other videos on the internet. As you can see, it is intricate and space effective. If you want, I can do a more in-depth video about what's in it in the future. Now for the main pocket inside. This backpack has a few hidden compartments, and one of them I use regularly. In the lower back pocket, I keep my emergency kit for any unexpected needs. It has three compartments inside to hold any of the items I may find myself wishing I had. The other item in this pocket is my agenda for planning and staying organized throughout my week. This one has a very basic layout, but it still goes a long way. For the rest of the inside, I have my 1.5 inch college notebook that holds my two classes and my two textbooks. I have additionally deeply organized my binder using a strategy that has helped me for two years so far. Comment down below if you would like to find out my method so that you can get some ideas for your classes this year. In the side pockets, I usually put in my phone, water bottle, pencil, or snack if preferred. I also put the occasional mask in there because, you know, corona. Anyway, I carry my lunchbox with me otherwise and that's about it for the beginning of my day. So now that you've seen what I bring to my college classes, I'm going to show you what I bring for the rest of my day, which is at the high school. So I switch out my stuff halfway through the day so that I have enough room in my backpack, obviously. So I guess I should show you what's in my backpack, again. For the nicer backpack, I had to sacrifice space for style, meaning I can't hold everything in it at once. So for the high school, I have a separate array of necessities. I have this one inch binder with my three subject notebook carefully placed inside, and my music folder for band class. I usually move over my other items except my agenda, for the high school doesn't schedule as many homework tasks or test dates that are urgent enough to document. And since it's marching band season currently, I will also place in my change of clothes, tennis shoes, and occasional bug repellent. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed my video and are ready for this next school year. I know it's going to be really crazy, but together we can get those grades and make the plays. Anyway, I'm just getting a little cheesy now, but um, just wanted to say I hope that I may have inspired you guys for some of your own ideas, and I also hope that you guys will comment down below if you want to see any videos on my binder organization or a what's in my pencil pouch video. So I guess that's all for this video. Again, I'm Kaylee Water Ninja, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Ninja, go!